What is up? Welcome back. It is time for the final four. We're taking on the Yukon Huskies, the two seed, while the Ohio State University is taking on Villanova. So a classic battle of blue bloods, minus Cleveland State, of course, but we're getting there. This matchup is unique because last season we played Yukon early in the season and we did beat them and handle them pretty well. So they are looking to get revenge. Teal was a rookie and put up 15 points, a great start to his career as we all know how that panned out. As we head in, wait, what's that? What do I hear? Breaking news. We have breaking news right before the final four. Chuck Teal sends out a tweet. Let's take a look. Chuck tweets, when I came to Cleveland State, it was a surprise to many. But I knew after meeting and speaking with Coach Kraft that this was going to be the place for me. My first year was not to be believed. Making the all-conference freshman team and more importantly, hoisting the national championship was a dream come true. Being named MVP didn't hurt either. Leading into this amazing tournament run, I had many discussions with my coaches and family. I have decided to forego the rest of my career at Cleveland State and enter the NBA draft. I wouldn't be who I am if it wasn't for my Viking family. We still have business to attend to. Two more wins to go. Now leave it all on the floor. Pound sign, back to back, pound sign, repeat. Thank you. Signed, Chuck Teal. So there you have it. Chuck is going pro. This is his last run in the NCAA. And we'll definitely see some more motion in the game. As to be expected, they're good. Let's take a look at the betting lines for this Final Four matchup. And it looks like Vegas dialed it back after the last two rounds with Cleveland State. Spread. Cleveland State is favored despite being the sixth seed at three and a half. Total points dropped down to 85 and a half. Prop bet sticking with Mr. March Madness. Teal in his last Final Four. Struggled getting the ball in the bucket last game against Georgetown in the lead eight. Teal's at 16 and a half points. Final Four, baby. Let's do it. And here we go, Final Four is underway. We are playing in a big stadium. Chuck trying to get off started hot here. Hands up. <laughs> there we go, nice little jumper there for you. Good defense, good defense. I'll take that. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, I don't take that. Get it back. Come on. Good board, Demps. Chuck's a little nervous. Chuck's a little nervous. Get it, he'll get it. All right, playing defense, he is though. Oh man, here we go with the brick show again. That was easy. I should be up six two right now. Oh man. That's tough. I'm not getting that board hurts. Gosh. Gosh, is this gonna be another 30 point game? Okay, thank you, Kinsey. Get up. Good. That's why you're in the game. Oh. Great board, Dems. Great box out. Man, Rivers hitting those, that's good. Yeah. All right, Chuck on the board. I see it go in. 
Oh, that's fine. Don't go in. All right. Oh, hand in the face. Oh, yeah. Oh, great hands. Can you take it all the way? You get cut off. No. Oh, my God, Andy. You get in the game and you do that. And one. Oh, whoo. I'm lucky there. Looks like we're in Indianapolis. <laughs> Man, they're missing those, huh? Yeah, he's feeling it. He's feeling it. That's right, you take a timeout. And a board, Chuck, way to go. Hmm. Good take. Yeah, I mean, them missing those is doing doing me good. That was sick. Kind of cheesy, but sick. Hmm. Uh, I believe the big fuck down low for UConn is Andre Drummond. Not a boy, Chuck. All right. Another familiar name on UConn here is Jeremy Lamb. Boy, Chuck. Well, that's the wrong way. Pull up. Kinsey, dude. Bloodbath. Oh, now they hit a shot. Ooh. Get out of here. Hell yeah, Demps. Man, they're missing those hurt. Ah, fuck, my bad. Oh, what the heck's going on here? Swat that crap. Alright. That was sweet. Up nine. Francis. Oh my god, Francis, you hot pile steaming garbage. Francis has made it a six point ball game. Fuck off with that shit. Oh my lord, Chuck. Wrong! Oh boy, we got problems. Ha! Yeah, fucking too easy. Thanks, Chuck. Boy, that was a big bucket. That really was. Cut off. Good cut off. Oh, Andy gets a board. Wow. Pass. 
Oh my god. That's not what I wanted. Great defense. Oh, what defense? Chuck is showing up on the defensive side. That's what he's doing. Great pull up. Good defense, Kinsey. Back up to 10. Jump. You didn't fucking jump, Francis. He's feeling it. Kinsey's feeling it. Come on, truck. Oh, that's contested. Nine up, five and a half to go. Beautiful. Ah. Jumping around like that. Hey, he jumped. Look what happens when you jump. Damn. All right, nine point game. Boy, Chuck's having a rough go. Cleaned up by Andy. But I'd say this probably is not Chuck's last game. Oh my god, that goes in. Ah, I don't mind it though. Who's guarding who? Oh! Chuck with the defensive play again. I'm not sure what's going on there. That's also not what I wanted to do. Jeez, now he's throwing up bricks. Three minutes left. For those betting at home, Mr. Chuck Teal has 17 points and has covered his prop, and we're gonna cover the spread. Oh. Wow. Not sure what's going on with UConn. That puts us at 85 total points. And took the over, you win your bet. All the overs hit today. Atta boy, Chuck. Natty time. Damn 
damn it. Oh, wow. Jesus, Chuck. I mean, I... That's all right. Last final four. How does he get that rebound, Andre Drummond? Yes, sir. And we are headed to the national championship. Good stuff, fellas. Classy. Taking a look at the stats in this Final Four game, Beal actually had 21 points. The way he was brooking the ball, I thought he would have been way less than that. 21 points for Chuck Teal. Kinsey, 19 points. He kept us in the game early, which is huge. Demps added five or seven. Some other points and folks sprinkled in. Now let's take a look at our betting lines. Spread, easily covered, three and a half. Total, 85 and a half. Covered that on the over. Prop bet for Teal, 16 and a half. He showed up. Mr. March, he also played really well on the defensive side of the ball. He had a complete game for the most part. We got the over in the 16 and a half points. Don't think you kind of expected to see this from the Vikings. But once again, we're a buzzsaw in this tournament right now. Let's go see who we're playing in the national championship. Damn. Villanova tops Ohio State, 95-82. Looked like there was a decent game. Man, did I want an interstate national championship. I wanted to play Ohio State. That would have been something cool, especially for Chuck's last game. National championship against Villanova. Once again, another rematch from past games. So we'll see you next time and see if we can hoist back-to-back -back championships.